Hi, it's Donna with Donna's Deals and DIYs, and I hope that you're having a wonderful day. Thank you so much for tuning in to my Dollar Tree haul. Uh, if you're a new subscriber, I appreciate you very much for subscribing to my channel. And if you are not a new subscriber and you've been a subscriber for a while, thank you for being loyal and continuing to watch my channel. And if you have not subscribed, please consider subscribing. Hitting that red button. Uh, red subscribe button. It is my goal to get to over a thousand subscribers by the end of May because I would like to not have to work uh, this summer. I would like to be able to take uh, the summer off like um, I should have. Um, the only way I'll be, I'll be able to do that is to uh, get to a thousand subscribers and be monetized. So please make sure you're watching my videos all the way through to help me get that playtime that I need and uh, or hours, play hours, whatever you want to call it. And then also please subscribe so I can get to a thousand subscribers. That is my goal. And I appreciate you so much helping me, um, very much. So, uh, let's get started with this Dollar Tree haul. But before I do, let me put my glasses on. I have a subscriber of the week and her name is Maria Ramirez. Thank you, Maria Ramirez. Ooh, I can't say that. Maria Ramirez, thank you very much for being such a loyal subscriber. And Stephanie's Crafts and Creations is my YouTube sister of the week. And I will link her below. So please go check her out. Get her, uh, give her some thumbs up, watch her channel, subscribe if you haven't, help her out. Help her grow her channel as well. Thank you so much. Okay, let's get started with this Dollar Tree haul with my thumbnail. And I'm gonna take my glasses back off since I don't have to read. Okay, this was kind of a shocking find. That's why I'm going to show it to you first. This had been $5. It is Greenbrier at the Dollar Tree. And as you can see, they marked it down to $1.25. But you can see that it has that $5 sticker. So it was a Dollar Tree Plus item. And I'm going to be honest with you. I never saw it in my store locally where I purchased this as a $5 item. I just saw it as a dollar and a quarter. And it is pajama pants for ladies. This is black and white plaid. Perfect, just in time for Christmas, pre-purchase for Christmas and red and black plaid. Now, one of these is an extra large and one of these is a large. So one of them is for my mother and one of them is for a friend. And so um, extra large and large, friend, mother. So uh, mom thinks that the large will fit her. So I showed them to her already, but we're saving them for her Christmas gift, but she already knows she's getting them. <laughs> So anyway, I've retied it here, but I they're long and she's probably gonna, she's short. Uh, she's like 4'11", so she's gonna have to take them up on the bottom because they're kind of, they're long pants. Uh, they're probably longer than hers. Now these others, the person that I got these for, she will not have to adjust her, she's tall. So um, anyway, that was a great purchase. It says Greenbrier, so it's not a different brand, but the material is very soft. I uh, love this red and black buffalo check. I really wish that they'd had some to fit me, but I have some already, but they're made out of thicker material that I got at Old Navy and um, they're really too big for me and I may not be able to wear them anymore. I may have to get me another pair. So if they'd had a 2X, I probably would have been able to wear them, but that's okay. I wasn't gonna go, you had to, you couldn't see the, unfortunately they, if I, there was a way to find out what size it was on this little ticket thing, um, I did not see it. Anywhere on here, it just said, ladies sleep pants, soft and cozy. And there was nothing about a size. Anywhere on here. But that's what they look like, the red pair and the white and black pair. Uh, love it, love it, love it. Very excited. I probably should have picked up some more, to be honest with you. But I knew that two of them would be gifts. Okay, so this is a boring, but uh, I have been sending a friend of mine some coupons. And I noticed that the smaller the package, the cheaper the price to send them. So. <laughs> I got this envelope to try to send some more in the future. And there's five in a package. They're peel and seal. Uh, I guess that's in the back, back here, peel and seal. And then um, they're made by Paper World, made in Mexico. And like I said, they're just Paper World. So, got that. I'm going to try to leave this makeup and stuff for last. Uh, okay, I picked this exciting thing. I was so excited to see this at my local Dollar Tree store just because of, I don't, I'm not a drinker, but it's just not something you normally see. So when you see something that you don't normally see, it kind of blows you away. So this is Jim Bean Bourbon Vanilla Flavored Coffee. Yeah, 
bourbon flavored ground coffee, bourbon vanilla, naturally and artificially flavored by Jim Bean. It's four ounces in their grounds. And the best buy is 718 of 2023. It's by whitecoffee.com from New York. And um, yeah, they had, and it says it does not have, it's non alcoholic. So it's just flavored like vanilla bourbon. I thought my brother might like these. I don't know if they have a if they have a regular coffee pot that's not a Keurig. If they do not, you can get those little pods that you can put the grounds down in and make some uh, coffee out of the Keurig with it. And so I'll get him one of those. They also had original, just original bourbon and then the bourbon vanilla. But I just picked this one up when I first saw it. I went, oh, that's something he would probably like. So I got it for him to go on his Christmas gift. All right. Exciting, exciting, exciting. Um, I found another one of these on sale for 50 cents, the Crafter Square vinyl paper, 50 cents as you can see it, and it was green. And I'm not a big fan of necessarily this Kelly green color, but these are my school colors. And so black, green, and white. And so I thought I'd go ahead and pick it up in case I ever need to make anything in the green for school. So that's why I picked it up for 50 cents, it's worth it. This was also just 50 cents. Right there. We found this on Monday when we were out shopping at some different some different local stores. Uh, in my local town, we have two Dollar Tree stores and we have the Dollar Tree Combo Family Dollar Tree store. Uh, family Dollar Dollar Tree Combo store that's real close to my house. Uh, the, in the town over, we have two Dollar Trees and then up the street, up the freeway on the way to Houston, which is only about 15, 20 minutes away, there is another Dollar Tree. Now those extra three Dollar Trees, I do not get to, but maybe once a month, if that. Um, just because I just don't have time. We've got local stores that I go to and uh, they don't really normally have a whole lot more than what we have, but I'm surprised. If I stay away long enough, I'll be surprised at what I find over there. And um, of course, I'd like to go up to Houston if I'm gonna go on a road trip, so. But we didn't really wanna go very far this weekend or this Monday, so this is just two piece metal tags and the copper. 50 cents, loved it. Don't know what I'm gonna do with them, but for 50 cents, I grabbed them. You may have seen me haul last week um, I had gotten a heart like this and I believe a house because I don't see the house. So I must have, I must have hauled it last week. But uh, this is just a little tag and it's made of ceramic and it's Greenbrier and it's in the Dollar Tree. And I thought a, a rub-on transfer would be really cool on this or some of those glass stickers would be really cool on this to uh, decorate for some kind of something or other. I picked up some glue sticks because I'm probably going to need some soon if I ever get around to crafting. I really wanted to craft this weekend, but as you guys can see, I did not. I did, however, make something that I did show you all. So let me tell you about it right now. I'm going to overlay a picture. It is for a sign for my door at school. It says Miss Donna on it because I like for the kids to call me by my first name, Miss Donna. And uh, I made that for outside of our door in our classroom so that they know the name of the teacher I work with and they know me and then we're right, that's our room. So uh, I made it with uh, a lot of the stuff that I got from the Dollar Tree Crafter Square section. So I didn't show y'all me making it cause I was in a real big hurry. So, uh, but I wanted to show y'all that I did do something crafty <laughs> and I will be soon and be recording it and making some new videos. I just don't know when. As soon as I have the energy. <laughs> Uh, six count wood rings. I've seen people hauling these, uh, and I just could not wait to find them. Like again, I don't know exactly yet what I'm going to do with them, but I got them because I thought they were cool. So, uh, the person who won my, uh, mystery giveaway for the uh, YouTube sister that has helped me out, her name was N on here, N period, and on, uh, Instagram, she's nifty thrifty 505, I think. I'll link that below just in case y'all need it. But uh, I had to ask her some things that she might want to go in her giveaway because I want it to be very personal for her. And she said mini plaid pumpkins. Well, I went ahead and picked these up because I didn't get her message until after I'd already left the Dollar Tree. So I went ahead and picked these up for her. She's also kind of crafty, so maybe she'll use them. So I got the red and black plaid and the white and black plaid because that's what they had in the store. So I'll be sending those to her. And then, but this is what she was really wanting, which I did pick up one of each. 
And so they say thankful on them. I was trying to get the thankful pulled around so you can see them. So I, I've already hauled these before. So this is a, I've hauled a couple of them before. So this is a rehaul. I did not get one like this before, but I picked her up one of these. I picked her up this one, which is the one that I purchased. My, uh, I purchased one like this for my mom. This is just a core from Greenbrier. And our store got them, and I was so glad they got them again so I could purchase them for her because I was afraid I wasn't going to be able to find them. And then I purchased one like this for myself. Uh, and that's just say thankful right there. Thankful. And this one, I love this one too. And um, it looks like that. So I went ahead and picked up all four of those for her and a couple of, a couple of other things to send her. And I need to get that package out by Saturday. Um, this is something that I picked up for a friend of mine who probably already has found them by the time I get them sent to her. But that's okay. She can either share them with somebody else or she can use them for herself. Or um, if she says she, if I say that she gets some, then I may put them in a giveaway. But this is the uh, Crafter Square fabric craft fabric 18 by 21 and it has the v print on it right there it's just white and black but i did see that they also had yellow and black check to go with it but they we our store didn't have them yet so i thought uh if i see the yellow and black check and i find it i'll get another half maybe they can make pillows with one side yellow and black check and one side this or whatever so uh if i do do end up in it giving a giving away stuff i will uh, put this in a giveaway i'll try to get the yellow if i ever find the yellow and black check i'll put it with it but I, we didn't have it in our store yet but anyway i thought this was really cool with the bees on it isn't that cool they also had some more and you'll see it in my walkthrough that i picked up uh, I found a little bit of fall decor. Oh, we're still on crafts. Sorry. Oh, well, we'll go into fall decor. We'll go back to crafts. I picked this up for, for myself. Uh, I may put it at work. Pumpkin spice and everything nice. I love this, y'all. You know I love the pumpkin spice. When I first saw them, I was like, no, I'm not going to pick it up. But now that I'm working so much on that bus, I said, you know what? It's time to pick up a couple of things for myself every once in a while. <laughs> So pumpkin spice and everything else. I love this little pumpkin. I just think it's so cute. So I might take it to work and decorate my desk at work with it for fall because um, I love me some pumpkin spice. So I picked that up for me and I picked this up for a friend. She said she hadn't found them yet. And by the time I get them to her, she probably will have. Let's hope not. If she has, then I know somebody else can use the S. Um, but it's just the monogram leaves from the Dollar Tree with the S on it. So, uh, yeah, it has the S. Yep, thought it was really cool. So, I have, an, uh, I have a friend whose last name starts with an S. So, if uh, she'll take it if uh, the other person finds theirs. I thought it was really cool. Love that. Did not have one with a D or a P. Um, this stuff, I have a bunch of makeup here. So, we're going to go through that in a minute. But uh, this is also pumpkin spice, so let's talk about it. Uh, it's called pumpkin butter, sorry. French toast and pumpkin butter luminescence fragrance oil. And you can put it in your little uh, oil burner and it smells really, really good. And I guess this is one of the new fall scents, pump, French toast and pumpkin butter. I thought it smelled really good, so I went ahead and picked that up. I believe Dina picked one up too, but I can't remember. She's the one who, she saw it and pointed it out to me. So that's why I like to take her with me because if I don't find it, she normally does. <laughs> and I was like, mmm, that smells good. I have to have it. So I'll be putting that in my oil burner. I don't have a fancy oil burner, so it doesn't have to have certain brand stuff in it. Then, y'all, I found some stickers that I absolutely love. Like I need some more stickers. Yeah, I don't. But y'all know I love them. So I went ahead and bought them from Crafter Square. These are 13 count pop-up stickers. And the reason I picked them up is because they have the fins. Yep. Had to have that fin, seashell, welcome to the pool, ride the wave. And it has a little uh, mask with a snorkel. And whoever made these didn't put them, line them up very good on this particular bunch, but I said I can fix them. I can fix them. But this was the best package out of all that they had. These were the best package. So I just went and picked them up because they were all a little wonky as far as how well, because they're 2D stickers. Uh, so yeah, they're 2D stickers and they have, yeah, yeah. we'll fix it or 3D, 2D, whatever you call it. 
I'll fix them. They just have that little tab on the back. So I can I can fix them in room, glue them back together. I wanted to get that for maybe some future scrapbooking or something. Then I got found these rub on transfers. I thought they were really cool. Thankful and the pantry. Or it has thankful the and pantry farm life. I don't believe why thankful and was in there, but anyway, because I don't see grateful. This says rub on transfers. I was looking to see if maybe there was a second page to it. But anyway, sorry guys, y'all don't want to see the top of my head. <laughs> These I thought were so cute. Rub on transfers. So I went and picked them up. Very farmhousey. Would look great on this. Yes, great on that. So if I could get them to work, they would look great. Then I picked up these, which were a wish list item. These next three stickers are wish list items. I've been looking for these for a while. Thought they were really pretty. They also would look really great on this. This one says, welcome home, rub on transfers. Welcome home, loads of fun. Simply blessed, families, everything, love, peace and joy and happiness is homemade. Love these. And family home, the best things together is my favorite place to be. Make it happen, everyday miracles. They built a life they loved. So cute. Oh, love these. Been looking for them for a while and was so excited to find them. So excited. Of course, they'll just come out with some more for me to look for now, right? Okay, exciting makeup finds. I picked this up specifically for a friend who likes purple. It's China Glaze uh, Nail Lacquer, and the color is Slay Your, Lin Slay Your Line, 1741 Slay Your Line. Beautiful purple color. I don't think it's coming off purple in there, but it, it is here. So kind of like a lavender dark purple. I think she'll really love that color. I also picked two, two of these up, one for me, one for a giveaway. It is T-I-G-I. Perfect lip liner, crayon contour. This one is called Kiss. Now y'all, wherever we found these, they people had taken them out of the box and they were everywhere. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous color. Kiss lip liner. Look how pretty that is. So yeah, I wanted to get that. Oh, look, yeah, there we go. It's got that on one side, that lip liner on that side. And then you have this on this side. Is that just the brush that, oh, I don't know. I'm guessing that's just the brush that smooths it out. Hmm? All right, this is for a giveaway, a future giveaway. It's Cover Girl. And it is eyeshadow 725 Breathtaking Blues. And this was the only colors that I saw. One, two, three, four. And it's by CoverGirl, dollar and a quarter. You cannot beat that for CoverGirl. Has a little applicator on there. Thought those were beautiful. And I don't really use these colors, but I thought somebody out there might, so it will go in a future giveaway. And some of these are for um, a friend and some of these are for giveaways. So I have the Day Club HS24. I purchased these for somebody very specific and then also to go in a giveaway. So hey, that's it's kind of a gold color. So these will be in a future giveaway. These are NYX professional makeup, makeup eyeshadows. Love NYX. I was very excited to find it at the Dollar Tree for a dollar and a quarter. So I got one, two, I think three of the day club. Yes, because I wanted to keep one. I wanted to give one in a giveaway and then I have a specific person who wants one. And then Flirt is a kind of a purple color and galactic is kind of a blue color and voyeur is kind of a turquoisey kind of blue color so uh saving some of these for the giveaway and some of them are going to uh somebody specific so anyway that's my dollar tree haul uh that is i purchased all of that in one week at five different dollar trees five yes five, wait a minute six if you count the combo store, but I didn't get much there. So, uh, 
five different Dollar Trees, my local area. This and my last haul came from. So I was pretty excited about what I found. So it's gonna take me forever to put all this stuff away. <laughs> anyway, guys, please check out my YouTube sister of the week. Please hit the thumbs up button. Please comment below what you're looking for, what your wish list item is, uh, what you liked in my haul. And also, uh, I ask the Dollar Tree uh, employee at one of our stores when they would be putting out Christmas. And she said at the end of September. So I know I've seen it on YouTube. I've seen it on Instagram. Other stores are getting it. That's what they told me about our stores here. It's kind of disappointing because I wanted to haul it for you guys. But if you haven't checked out my uh, previews of the Dollar Tree website for Christmas. I have one video. I'm about to put out another one, which you already saw, I'm sure, because by the time you see this video, I have already posted it. And if there's any more new stuff, I'll make a third one. So I'll keep you updated on what's new on the website as far as Christmas goes anyway. Um, just remember that uh, you're loved. I love you. God loves you. God bless you. And have a great week. Bye-bye.